This is Brian, and welcome back to this commentary playthrough of Breath of Fire 2. So yeah, we're making our way through the Sky Tower here, and I did go the wrong way, at least, well, the right way the first time, but in doing so, I'm pretty sure I missed out on a few treasures. Yeah, here we do have to deal with more of a current. Ah, oh, okay, it gives us an air room right here. Any cell stuff? That's interesting. He sells the earth armor, but I do have access to better stuff than that. Okay, that's not better than anything that I have available. But I do need to get another one of these, or a couple more of these. Those two. Well, I'm going to go forward here. And if it happens that I can't come back in here, I guess we just missed that shop. Kind of like the guy in the wise tree. But I'm going to proceed as if I can come back in here because I don't want to leave and come back. If I find a good place to enemies drop a lot of money or if I find a good place to raise money I might come back and do a little grinding off screen there's no air here if you want to go back now's the chance so yeah he's telling you could um could be a while before you're able to get out of here yeah, I think this is the room I was thinking of that has treasures hidden I don't see anywhere else to go down here, and I'm pretty sure I'm still missing a couple treasures. Shield, is that like defense up? Or is that like a magic shield? No, it didn't save him at least. Okay, got a level up at least. This could be pretty tedious. That's not necessarily good. Yeah, a spell that hits everybody for 70 to 80. So if this guy does that again, it might wipe out a couple of my party members. Okay, we're fine. It does seem like this wouldn't be a terrible place to... Oh wait. I guess I can go over here yet, so there is another room. Never mind, I might have wasted a little time here then. And Monica? Nice counterattack. Go ahead and build up, because I don't think you'll get another turn. Ah. Uh, this is part of the thing that'll make it last a little longer down here. Okay, we got another room like this. Another current room here. Goblin sword.
Okay, that is better. That brass sword sells for quite a bit. I guess I can go back to that armory guy if I make it through here. There, I think that's the last item I need. And at least after I get that, I can let the current take me back. More quickly. Spirit robe? Not better for my guys that can wear heavy armor. Not better for anybody. Unless it's better, like, for magic users. I could see something like that. I think if I'm going straight through, a minute should be enough to get out of here. Oh yeah, the time speed, or the music speeds up too, though. Pretty well on the encounters here, too. Okay. Yeah, no problem. I don't want to sell that just because it might be better for somebody else. Same with these. I'm gonna hold on to those. Sword, though, I know that was just Ryu. I will sell that. Something's telling me maybe I shouldn't, but... Not like it's going to be a best in the game type of thing anyway. And that's a pretty big upgrade for him. As is that. Yeah. Go for that. Can I get one more of these? Those are worth 900, so that's... I need, like, 500. What can I sell? Sell some of my roasts. This isn't much of an upgrade, but... A little bit, so I'll take it while I'm here. Alright, now we just need to go straight back through the other way over here. Now, I'm already messing up. It was over up the... through the door here and up the stairs. I'd have plenty of time. I could go ahead and take those guys out if I want, but let's just keep moving forward. Okay, I'll take these. He'll probably get one attack off with his build-up, so that could hurt a little bit. That's all he gets, though. I remember this place being a little more... I don't know. The time constraint being more of a big deal than this. I would say maybe it's because I'm level up pretty well, but I don't know. Some of the previous areas have been a little bit tough to get through. Could also depend on what party you're bringing along, though, I suppose. Maybe this one just works out pretty well for me here.
little bit of overkill, but we'll take it. Pushes you against every wall. I set up a little bit, but I should be okay. We're almost there. The bleed off. I think I actually will take this one. I know I skipped another one before, but... Those guys really don't do much to that guy. He will get an attack off, but it shouldn't be strong enough to kill any of my guys. Well, and especially with a dodge. Way to go, Bao. Doesn't seem like Bao does very much damage against these guys. Wonder if that's because of the icy bow or there's some other factor at play. All right, well, let's talk to the shaman. Spore. What? You guys? Huh? You came to stop the fog? <laughs> Sorry. The wind shaman. I was bored, so I was blowing fog here and there. <laughs> but if it's bothering you, I'll stop now. Well, better go back to Granny. Okay. Another shaman unlocked. I think I can just exit out of here. Although, I am going to want to check and see if I can still go in. You guys like to go in? No, but I'm glad that I have the option. Because that armory isn't too far in there. I would go ahead and warp back to Township right now, but you can't do it from Grandpa. Well, at this point, I guess I might as well just swim all the way back there. I was thinking about trying to find a beach closer at hand, maybe, but, eh. Could have gone west, I suppose, if I wanted to do that. Well, I am going to change... Well, first, let's walk into the the headquarters here, just so we get the free heal for everybody. I am going to put some of these people in, just to make sure that any of that equipment that I picked up isn't better for them. For like him, yeah, I kind of assumed that that dagger was going to be better. I think I put all the new stuff on Sten, so that should take care of that. I don't think I have anything better for them, probably. I guess I do have that robe. 
Or no, did I sell that? Yeah, I did, okay. Yeah, but I don't think it would have been any better, so... I'm fine with that. Now, going forward... Do I want to... Do I want to change my party out yet? Uh, I don't think I will. So the only one I'm really going to mess with here, I'm going to change Spar's Unite list. I think Spore also works for Sten, if I remember right. Uh, so yeah, they say Spoo here because I don't have enough letters for it. So I don't think the appearance is going to change. It's going to be Sprite again, but it'll actually... Could increase some other statistics. Like I think, I think the wind shaman works for defense. So defense should be up a little bit. Dude, was this the armor shop guy? sell my other stuff and see if I can get anything else new with him. That's not better than the one I can get in the tower, so not going to do that. And we can get better stuff than this. Actually, for Bao, I'm not sure if I can. And just checking Beretta's stuff. Okay, yeah. So, Guns and Sky Tower are the shops that I'm working on upgrading at, I guess, for now. And maybe with um, the guy in the township here. Too bad Sky Tower doesn't count as a place we can go to. Because <laughs> it seems like that'd be a little faster. I suppose... Let's go to Tunlin. We'll go ahead and take the beach here and then head west to Whale Cave. This is the one that's farther south. This is the one I want.
Now we should be able to head south through the valley here. Okay, and this guy's different. I try eye. And well, he does have three eyes, so does that make sense? Yeah, not too bad for a single enemy. Alright, that guy's gone too. Oh, but there are enemies in here. Yeah, we've seen this guy before. Dropped an herb. Ooh. That's something good, huh? Pretty sure there aren't any items or anything in here you just go through. Cyclops, huh? Seems like he has pretty high physical defense. And that's probably not great. Since those guys can only hit for one damage, I'll try their magic. Yeah, that's better at least. Yeah. Try to take him out. Oh, Jesus. Holy shit. He can one-shot anybody? That's not good. Alright, we're not messing around now, buddy. Okay, a lot of experience. Level 25 for Jean. I was gonna go back and check out... Yeah, and since Spar died, that's gonna take away his Unite ability. I haven't even used this yet, so yeah, there we go. It did actually work. I was going to go back and check out that other side, but yeah, not if I'm going to run into more of those guys in there. Forget that. I was actually going to go check out something over here. There's that sign over on the beach there. An M Golem, huh? Well, hopefully you're not as bad as the Cyclops. Well. Doesn't seem too easy. Tells me one thing for sure, I'm not going to be messing around in this part of the world too much. Or else we're going to have to stop and do some leveling up or something. Because it does seem like a difficulty spike here. Can you see guns in the east? Well, I didn't see it right here, but I have seen it.
think we can just auto him. Yeah, it's mostly the fact that my characters in the back row don't really seem to do any physical attack damage that I could use more of a magical character in the back row, I suppose, maybe. Yeah, maybe that means it's about time to swap out Jean or Spar. The best utility that I have for Jean right now is the fact that um, he can help me get around on the world map a little faster here. Okay, these guys will hopefully be a little easier. A gallop. They're not hurting Ryu too much, at least. A couple counters and a couple specials, and they're gone. Okay, Ryu level 32. Okay, there is a place, a little cave there. Okay, I'm gonna go to that red dot up north of me yet first here. I think that's another tree I can talk to, yeah. Gotta be spar. When they receive a lot of contributions, the people of Namanda feel good. And they bring donations to me. When you go to Namanda, be generous with contributions. Okay. Don't believe we know what Namanda is yet, but we'll be generous when we find them. I think it might actually be this place. Can I actually go in here? Amanda is the god of earth and crops. Agriculture god. Colon. This is Namanda. A place dedicated to the god of the earth and crops. Maybe we can go in here, yeah? Beyond this point is where we are trained. General public is not allowed. Okay. Well, I guess we'll come back later. Because, yeah, we did see this town from Grandpa the Whale. And this will be our next destination. And there's some pigs here, so yeah, this is like an agricultural community, I suppose, that is close to Namanda. And let's go stay at the inn and see if we can find any items in here first, I suppose. These things usually have items. For healing item. Nothing in that one. Fifty, that's not too bad. And you'll notice something about this town. It's Rand's people. We got big bodies, but we're suited for handling pigs. Don't you think? I guess. Yeah, so that guy's out in the middle of the pig pens. We can't talk to him. Ah, this job. So boring. I want to go to work in the city. I want to go to the city to work. Okay. If we work hard in the garden, our prayers will be heard. Eve ho! got to go to St. Amanda to pray for a good harvest. Here we got an item shop, it looks like. Do they have anything different? Yeah, I guess I'll get more of those to stock up. We got fishing bait.
All right. So, got three houses, well, two to enter here. The one's door is blocked off to us. We probably get out that door from in the other one there. I think we're going to go ahead and call it there for today. So we'll pick up here next time and find out what's going on with Farmtown and Rand's people. Pretty sure that's what, it, what it's called, is just Farmtown. Anyway, thanks for watching, and if you've been enjoying the content so far, please like, comment, and subscribe or follow, and we'll catch you next time.